Because the there's question. going to be collusion. That is a fact. <coughs> uh, they are exercising their democratic right to pick we will, we and will, article 37 that we are We will exercise later, our constitutional right also. But how are you, Remember, as, as Kenya Kwanza member, member of the parliament, how are you going to handle it to counter <coughs> Uh, because we all know what really happens. If Remember, police comes and approaches Kenya, Azimio during their protest, we've seen what really happens. Remember, what's going to be different? Remember the right of other person right. to enjoy an environment that is peaceful, mm. a natural environment, we, which does not have the chaos which we have seen. Mm. The right to public safety and the right to uh, public order. Mm -hmm. We will ensure there is public safety we will ensure other person will enjoy public order. We will ensure uh, the right of other person mm. to carry on on his or her business mm. without any interruption will be achieved. Okay. There's no reason why the children of this city will not go to school on Wednesday. Okay. We will ensure the schools on Wednesday will be open and kids of this city and town, major towns in Kenya will go to school. Mm. We witnessed as Wednesday all schools in Nairobi were closed. Why should my children not go to school? Why should their children not go to school? Just Why? To, um, so the thing is, uh, this is coming to an end uh -huh. on Wednesday. Okay. We will face Raira Odinga and his team end on. Okay. What do you make of that? I'm curious to know how they are going to protect. That is, that is, that because there is there's going to be collusion. That is a fact. If they bring their supporters, and Azimio have their own supporters, of course it's, it's going to be worse. It's going to be chaos. Not to say that Azimio has failed on the threshold of Article 37. Mm. You should be peaceful mm. and unarmed. Mm -hmm. That is a fact. But I'm wondering, you know, if they add their supporters in the whole mix, it's going to be a mess. <coughs> and I want Kenya Kwanza to also sit back and ask themselves, this conversation that the president is going around the world, talking about the dollar, about financing, he has told us about CIA. Let's talk about the conspiracy theories. Mm -hmm. Maybe the fact that he's even touching the currency that is known, you know, probably the, the ones who are even behind the upheaval. Yeah. We know what happened in Libya. So first and foremost, even the government should choose their enemies wisely. Don't go around to, to, to trying to poke people's eyes and then you're expecting to see peace. Because mm. we don't know what the international th what the international community or the big brother or some thinks about Kenya. So first let's avoid such conversations that are making us Kenya.